Hey, how you doing today? My name is Brilliant. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today we're playing Dave the Diver and I'm going to show you how to get the Pelican Eel Skin, which is an upgraded material that is required in order to get the Steel Net Trap. And once you do, you are going to be able to trap some much larger fish than you were ever able to get before with the regular traps. Uh, some of the things that you're going to be able to do is you're going to be able to get the Tuna Fish with the Steel Net Trap and you're going to be able to refill your ammo just like with your normal net gun uh, because normally if you want to catch tuna fish you have to use uh, either a ton of harpoon hits deal a ton of damage or you have to buy a steel net trap and you only get like two or three of those per dive but with the steel net trap gun you'll be able to get a bunch of attacks you'll be able to catch a bunch of fish so let's go ahead and jump right in in order to get this gun the material that's a little bit harder to come by is the pelican eel skin you can find the topaz in a late game area and once you find it it's kind of all over the place getting a large net's not so hard and also getting a steel rope is just something that you can buy from the mer people a little bit later so the pelican eel skin there's actually only one fish in the entire game where you can get this from so let me show you where to go it's actually not that hard if you've already made it to the place where you can get topaz what you're going to do is make your way to the glacial area but you're going to make your way to like the beginning glacial area so once you get over the sea people village we're going to make our way over here we're going to make our way up to the top and again, this is kind of later game stuff. So if you've never made your way into this ice area over here, that means you also don't have any topaz and you're not gonna be able to upgrade this weapon. Once you enter this ice cave, this is the glacial passage, right? And you'll be able to swim straight down. This is a second room. Keep coming down into a third room. If this is your first time here, um, this is gonna be locked. Heck, I'm even pretty sure that this area up here might be locked. You, you have you have to kind of do some stuff. Uh, I think yeah, there's there's a room to the right. You'll you'll solve a couple of little puzzles. They're not that hard. And then by the time you solve the puzzles on the right side of the room, you'll eventually open up this area and the lower door. But if we keep coming down to the third area, see this, this fish that's angry at me right now? Well, we can go ahead and fight this fish. Uh, it's gonna take a couple of hits. I've got the max upgraded harpoon, and even this is gonna take me a couple of hits. One thing that you can do is if you've got a gun, you might wanna come here with a gun. There we go, pelican eel, and did we get it? Pelican eel skin, let's go. So now what we can do is make our way back to the boat. But you know, we can't we can't just go through all this and like not like catch anything, right? We, we might as well use up our ammo. All right, so we make our way back to the boat, turn in all of our fish for some sushi meat. We're gonna head over to the weapon shop, hit X to upgrade our net gun over to the steel net gun. Ooh, I love these cutscenes. <laughs> it's absolutely ridiculous steel net gun unlocked so we got a magazine of six and this is going to be so good so why would you even want a steel net gun well let's go ahead and dive in and i'll show you so again late in the game in the blue hole area eventually you were going to come across an event for tuna fish and the only way to get the tuna fish is with a steel net, which is something that you can you can pick up with these little uh, uh, unmanned water vehicles. That's how you get them to, to three stars. You can fight these guys by hitting them with your harpoon, but it takes forever. So if you want to get the tuna fish, the yellowfin tuna, and... Uh, Oh, I think that it's a sailfish. I forget what else. There might be one other fish that you can get with these things. But anyways, you're going to want that steel trap. It also allows you to catch some of the bigger fish as well. Not these sharks. These sharks are going to be too big. It, it just it just doesn't work on them. But this should work. Aha! Oh, we can't actually pick it up. So, oh, are you just stuck in there? I should be able to kill you while you're in this trap, but apparently we can't. 
I didn't know that. We just learned it together. So now now this, this fish is just in there. Oh, but I can just chop him up. There we go. I don't need to use my harpoon. I will catch you and your friend. Woo. The only other way to catch these things is to buy a uh, uh, a trap. And they're not super expensive on gold for the traps, but you only get three of them. Two of them? Two or three of them, something like that. So now, when you have it set up as a gun, you get six of them, and you can refill as you go, and it saves you so much time versus trying to harpoon all of the different tuna. So there you go. If you found the video helpful, do me a favor, subscribe to the channel, or you know what, J just like the video. You know what, that, a bare minimum, just, just, just hit that like button, all right? And if you wanna see even more Dave the Diver videos, you have to leave a comment and let me know. I don't know how many of you are gonna watch these videos. Thank you so much to my members. Thank you for watching the end. My name is Relia, and I'll talk to you again more real soon. Thanks, bye.